Four of the last five SEC tournaments were won by South Carolina. It would have been five in a row. But last year, 10 seed Arkansas stopped them from making the championship game. This year, head coach Don Staley has her team two wins from redemption. But once again, the Razorbacks are in the way. Now, with a team like Arkansas, they eliminated y'all last year. How do you how do you approach it? Yeah. I play them this year. I hope they don't eliminate us this year. <laughs> They're hard to defend because they just, you know, they just dribble down and pull up. And if your if your defensive uh, transition is off by an inch or two, they make you pay for it. Right. Ah, ah, ah. Here we go, y'all. We trimmed the fat off of off of all the talk very early on this season, so there's no need to keep talking. Okay, game plans are left up to you. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, oh, oh. oh. You go, we on three. three one, two, three. Whee! <laughs> Keys to the win transition D. No threes, no rim runs. No threes, no rim. Don't retreat, okay? If they're coming down, you have to get two feet outside the three-point line. Meaning don't drop back and, and wait. No, they want to stop and pop, okay? And then the tangibles, keep your guard up. Keep your guard up, guard up. And then lastly, you're the best bench in the country. That's one, do your job. Okay, questions? Nope, play hard, play smart, play discipline. Let's go, Good crowd here at Bonsecor's Wellness Arena, as you might expect. Semifinal round, the top seed South Carolina Gamecocks getting set to take on the number five seed and 25th ranked Arkansas Razorbacks for the second straight year. Soon after opening tip, the Razorbacks catch fire from the outside. If they keep this up, they can beat the Gamecocks once again. Here's side to Daniel, the freshman tries a three, got it. Back-to-back three for Arkansas. It's six to three. Great energy! Hell of a start! Good! I want our first look to be to get the ball inside because they're so elevated. And once we get that ball inside a few times, they'll not give you the room to operate, to make passes and all of that. Boston trying to drive into the lane, a little hook shot up and in, and the Gamecocks have their first lead. Ty Harris delivers left side to Henny. She'll spot him for three, left elbow. Bang! played against so they're going to close out quicker you got to be sharper you got to be crisper we can't be long and flowing they got to be short tight and compact and a rebound to the Razorbacks quickly down the floor Ramirez open for three left corner and she buried it stop back Penland Destiny Henderson has been crushing it to her second three ball she's up to ten it's okay Destiny Henderson, her third three-pointer, and the Gamecocks lead 36-23. As the first half ends, South Carolina is beating Arkansas in every facet of the game. of threes for the Gamecocks as they hit five in the first half. And they'll go into the locker room, leading Arkansas. There's not another team in America that's played the number one team in America three times yet this year. We're the only ones. And I know your legs are dead, and I know your mind's dead because we've played two straight days. But for 10 minutes, push that down. See what we can do in 10 minutes. They are focused. The Razorbacks hope to topple the Titans once again. Holtry will drive the length of the floor, lay it up and in. Foul, count the basket, chance for a three-point play. Gamecocks didn't bring their game out of the locker room. They swing it over to Ramirez in the corner, boom! And Ramirez is feeling it. And the lead is all of a sudden 
down to 10 and 50 to 40. I like this team. <laughs> I like this team right here. Inside to Boston, beats her man and lays it in. Shot clock at eight, hitting for three. Back! Got it again! And he thought about the three, drives to the foul line instead, 15 foot cover, banks in. She's fouled, count the basket, have a career day. Destiny Henderson. Arkansas are victims of fate. Destiny Henderson comes off the bench to score 21. The Razorbacks are disappointed as the Gamecocks dance to the finals. The Gamecocks are headed to the SEC Tournament Championship for the fifth time in six years. That's pretty good. Good luck. Welcome to the crowd, you guys. Super proud. Super proud. Um, you took that hit and you didn't flinch. I didn't either. I didn't want to call a timeout. Didn't want to give them a satisfaction. I knew we, we, we'd get things under control, and we did. You pushed the ball down and throws, okay? And I never, I never would imagine us making more threes than they did, but we did. Yeah! yeah. yeah. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Mississippi State to make it to its fifth straight Southeastern Conference Tournament Championship game. They've got to get through the Kentucky Wildcats. That's not going to be an easy feat. Let's go, let's go, let's go. From the tip, from the tip. All day, all day I've been waiting to watch the Wildcats play. All day. All you got to do is go be the Wildcats tonight. Let's go show them Kentucky basketball. Let's go. Let's go. What do you say, partner? Brother. Man, uh, good luck. We'll, we'll know in a couple hours, won't we? <laughs> Probably about right. Hey, good luck to you. You, you. you as well. Execute. We don't get what we want. Don't force it. Get them through, and let's get into dribble drive. Get your boys, get going. Turn it loose. We've been waiting to watch you play all day long. Let's go. Together, one, two, three. Number 10, Ryan Howard, is one of the best players in college basketball. She wills Kentucky to the early lead. Howard guarded by Jackson, gets past Jackson, gets to the SEC logo, to the triple. It just goes through the net, and the net never moves. Howard scores it, and it's 7 to 2 Kentucky. Howard It's all 7 of Kentucky's points. We're doing a good job now. We've got her under control, and everybody else wants to relax. Hey! We do a good job now. We everybody else has to play. You did fine. She got the first seven. Now we've done a decent job, but go rebound. Everybody go rebound. Jackson over in the right corner didn't have a shot. Now we'll drive to the lane. Goes left side off the window. Scores for the left hand. The Bulldogs finally untangled their offense. On defense. They are still getting tied up. Wildcats on top. Patterson, top of the circle. Step back three. And it's good. That's the 4 3 by the Wildcats hey, here in the now. first half of play. And Vic Schaefer takes the coat off. Girls, you can't win if you're not going to be focused on the game plan. If you're going to go down there and stand around and not have contact. We've gotten to the rim every time we've gotten into dribble drive. We've got to be better and tougher. We are losing the toughness battle. That's the Hunter. Oh, 
so smart to drop it in there. When freshman Rakia Jackson gets physical, the Bulldogs follow. They attack their way back into the game. Driving it right baseline, pull up jumper. Jackson got it. We could see a Jackson Howard show. At least Jackson has that capability. Nice move by Rakia Jackson. Bulldog scores six straight, 22 20. Right handed dribble takes it down the lane, pushes it up high off the window. It's going. Good. Drives it left side, now right side. Little step back, free throw line, extended shot. Kick. Ryan Howard's just hard to defeat. Y'all can switch on Howard now. If there's a screen, if one of your girls said it's a screen on Howard, switch. Shot clock is off, seven seconds, six seconds. Patterson with a three ball, it's good. Patterson hits the three. With the clock winding down, Chastity Patterson hits a three. Kentucky with a three ball, he's... In the first half, they're up 35 32. Down at the half, Mississippi State must find a whole new level of aggression. It is physical. It's just the way it is this time of year. You won't play another game now until the season's over, where you're going to call a bunch of ticky tacks. Jackson leads the way, and the Bulldogs follow. Jackson takes it towards the basket, pushes it off the window. It's good, and she's fouled. Mingo Young takes it to paint, swings it over to Danbury, takes it over the end line. Jackson left elbow jumper. Good. We're going to get it in here every time. She is, she is, she's gotten to the rim. They can't guard us. Our energy is much better than theirs right now. Much better. Jackson throws down the left lane line, pushes it off the window and scores. Rakia Jackson at 25. <laughs> Takes it away on the wing. Inbound pass. She's running along to the basket. Scores from the right side. Right hand. Number 20, Amaya Morris, takes over on both ends of the court. Mississippi State is playing like a champion. The perfect time. Morris is in double figures. Takes it over the line to Johnson. It's over, and the Bulldogs are going back to the SEC championship game to try to defend the 2019 SEC Cumberland title. Good game, buddy. Good luck. In the it's tournament. the fifth straight season the Bulldogs will be in the trophy grabbing game. Way to go, Way to go. Go senior fans. Go dogs on three. One, two, three. Proud of you, baby. Go. Come on. I'm so dead gum proud of you. Thanks, Carl. I'm so proud of you. Thank you. God, you were good tonight. Hey, I hope that's your coming out for. Tonight we were tough. And that's what I told you in pregame. This time of the year, it's about toughness. We've always prided ourselves on that, Joe. We've always prided ourselves on toughness. And I thought we were tougher tonight. Can we back it up? That's the question. This will be year five in a row now that we've been in this game. And we've only won it one time. And I've been against that team for four of them. What will be the fourth time tomorrow? We know what it was like, like the first time. You better bring an attitude, you better bring some toughness, okay? As the SEC Women's Tournament Final approaches, Gamecocks head coach Don Staley is calm. All season, South Carolina basketball worked hard for this day. Now, no distraction can shake their focus from winning. If something happens in a Intense practice, that's funny, that laugh. Mm -hmm. But then let's get back to business. And, and 
forgiveness about trusting your team that they're able to do that. Don't waste a step trying to get recover. Get to the weak side. Something's gonna happen, either an offensive rebound or they're gonna lob it up, up top to her. So just get in there and get in her way and not give up an uncontested layup. Here we go, we on three. <laughs> the South Carolina Gamecocks are in search of their fifth Southeastern Conference Tournament title in six seasons, but a familiar foe is making their fifth straight appearance in the championship game and looking to go back to back. Keys to the win, you got to pressure the disrupt. You know, although we're playing off, you can still pressure. Folks, you got to dominate today. Okay? You got to dominate. You got to dominate. One, two, three, yeah. Crowd on its feet here, and it's a packed house here at Bon Secours Wellness Arena. Good luck today. You've got a heck of a, got a, heck of a team and have a heck of a year. Congratulations on being coach of the year. Thank you. Good luck to you. You too. Everybody wants to see this matchup, the Gamecocks and the Bulldogs. This isn't an SEC rivalry. This is a national rivalry, and a lot of eyes and ears are going to be on this game today. Tip controlled by Mississippi State. We're underway here in Greenville. One down, screen it further out. Hey! Dan Berry down the right lane line, scores it off the window with the right hand, and the ball is on the board first. Outlet to Ty Harris. Ty quickly ahead to Bree Beal. Beal left side trying to go baseline, but the off the glass and in. She's fouled, count the basket. Chance for a three point play. Rakia up here, over there! Hand it off to Jackson, who was going off as a her way, goes from the right wing, throw jumper, foul, score! Rakia Jackson with four points, she'll go to the line, and Ty Harris is gonna prove her case. 133 to play in the first, Gamecocks leading by nine. Jackson, down the right of the key, kicks it back out on the wing to Wiggins. Mafaru sets up left wing three on the way, yes! Malia Mafaru gets the big three! Well, actually, ball safe and going out of bounds by the Gamecocks. Here they come in transition. It's Lily Grisette. Drives, shoots, blows the layup. Ty Harris gets the rebound, so pull it back out. Missed opportunity is an easy two. And then we almost throw the ball away. Saxton underneath the basket goes high off the glass and in. Turnovers are killing us. Everything's transition off a of turnover. The Gamecocks lead by eight with 10 minutes in the books. It's 18 to 10. Defense isn't that bad. We're getting kicked on the boards a little bit. Toughness, block that shot. Zaya Cook. Zaya Cook pulls up from the free throw line. Got it off the dribble, and it's 32-16. Time out, girl. Everything they're getting is off penetration and a layup. They haven't shot a jump. They're doing what we want to do. What Mississippi State does not want to do is get frustrated as they fall behind. Oh, Herbert Harrigan and Morris exchanging some words. It's double technical. Herbert Harrigan and Shania Morris. I like the competitiveness, but you don't get into a situation like that. Can't do that. Zaya drives, puts an off balance shot up and in. Oh, what a finish by Zaya. Here comes Danbury in transition. Drives the length of the floor, slotted away again by Kiki. You think Kiki Herbert Harrigan is fired up right now? <laughs> Jessica Carter just gave it right back to Herbert Harrigan. Kiki's already got the one technical. At halftime, one team leads, but neither will back down. This is one of the most glorious rivalries in the nation. The Bulldogs and the Gamecocks have won the last five SEC tournaments. One of them will win another in the next 20 minutes. Cook up top, passes left to Bree Beal. Underneath to Kiki, on the baseline, guarded by Chloe Bibby, trying to back her way in, knifing in, puts it up, and rolls it in for two. And the Gamecocks lead, 40 to 22, Kiki with eight points. She can download to Boston. Beats her man, there it is, 47-30. We are really, we are absolutely you're absolutely killing me how unaggressive we are. We let her back down. We're not athletic. We don't jump up. If you're not going to guard, just come sit down. South Carolina is serene, and the game shows it. 
They create clean looks on offense while allowing none on defense. Tries to drive the lane left side. Spins back to her left. Puts it up off the glass. No good. Boston with a rebound. The game got it. Long outlet pass to Kiki. She's too far to the cone. To find Zaya who finds three. Look at the ball for Carolina. Gosh, that's pretty. My goodness, the Gamecocks pouring it on here in the second half. Driving into the lane, left side, rolls it in for two. Their energy right now, it is a track meet. I told you guys, there was going to be a point proven today. And if you weren't ready, this is what would be happening. The Bulldogs are the defending champions. They will not surrender their title without a fight. Don Staley is the conference coach of the year. She reminds her team to stay calm and finish strong. Stolen by Lily Grisette along the far sideline. Tiptoe on the sideline. Lily takes it to life of the floor. Two more. Lily, the graceful one for seven points. L.A. one-on-one, trying to drive on Daria Wiggins, puts it off the glass and in. No team in the SEC can beat South Carolina, and the rest of the nation better watch out for the Gamecocks. Let there be no doubt, the South Carolina Gamecocks are SEC champions. Didn't give you much of a game, but you got your the team. Congratulations yeah. on your championship. For the fifth time in six years, the Gamecocks will cut down the net at the SEC tournament. They defeat Mississippi State 76 to 62. South Carolina is the number one ranked team in college basketball and SEC champions once again. To win this league the way you did, to win the tournament the way you did, is not an easy thing. I'm proud of you, I'm proud of our coaching staff. They've done a hell of a job putting us in a position to win a lot of basketball games, and we're not, we're not done yet. Congratulations, y'all. Congratulations. Y'all really deserve this blessing. I'm sorry? <laughs> Here we go. We all 